How to record a video podcast using your iPhone. If you're looking into starting a video podcast, but you don't want to invest in high-end equipment, then you found the right video. Because in this video, I'll be showing you my iPhone setup to record a video podcast with up to two people. You might be asking yourself, is this video for beginners? No, not necessarily. In my opinion, iPhone cameras are so good now, they're actually competing with high-end DSLR cameras with very expensive prime lenses. In fact, this video isn't even about making a video podcast on a budget because even the latest iPhone itself isn't cheap. And as far as the mics, well, you can use almost any mic at any price point to pull this off. This is all gonna just depend on how you want things to sound. Okay, first thing is first. You're gonna need a few main things to start, like an iPhone, of course. Today, I'm using the 13 Pro Max. I recommend the iPhone 12 or later. Earlier iPhones will work, but the camera quality isn't really that good, in my opinion. You'll also need an audio device. This is where you'll run all of your mics and headphones straight to your iPhone. When it comes to audio devices, there are so many varieties, it's almost, it's just so hard to choose one because they're all so freaking cool. So I won't be specific in this video on which one you should use because they all work the same. They each have their own benefits and it's really just a matter of preference and what stokes you the hardest. For this video, I'm using the Zoom H6, a couple of mics and some headphones. This will also depend on how many guests you want on your podcast, and also how many inputs your audio device can take. Mine can take four, but it can go up to six. But for this video today, it's just gonna be me. And finally, you'll need an iPhone adapter. Let's set up the audio first. This isn't gonna be a full-blown tutorial just because this setup can vary depending on your equipment, but the concept is the same for all of them. First, plug in your mics to the audio device using an XLR cable. Then, plug in your headphones so each guest can monitor their own audio. I actually had to buy this headphone amp to plug in multiple headphones. Connect your audio device to your iPhone using this little adapter. So this is where the magic kind of all happens. Because of this little adapter, it's a USB to lightning port. If your device doesn't have a USB output, but it has a traditional line out, be sure to use this other little adapter, a 3.5 mil to lightning. With this method, you have to make sure that your line out cable has a TRRS tip. Just look for the three rings. This is what's gonna make it compatible with iPhone. Now it's time to set up your iPhone. Place it on a tripod and set it to your likings. I recommend using the default camera app, shooting in 4K at 30 FPS. That's right, 30 FPS. If you're looking for that sweet bokeh look, then be sure to shoot in cinematic mode. I would recommend plugging in your audio first so that your iPhone recognizes it right away. Then dial in your video settings on your iPhone. Do a quick test and record. Make sure everything looks and sounds great. Then you're ready to shoot your podcast. Hey, thank you for watching this video. If you made it this far, it means that you really, really want to shoot a video podcast with your iPhone. If you end up making a video podcast, please send it my way. I'd love to check it out. And if you like this video, please be sure to hit the like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching. And until next time, peace.